Hello, this is Craig. I built a very simple prototype of a rhythm game I.O. system. So, I've got the system where where you get a rhythm game. Right now it creates a random pattern and uh, instead of having music it's just got I don't know if you could hear it or not. I doubt it. Um, I don't really have it set up to record the music. But the idea is, is with this rhythm game is that you're not trying to do a song. You're not trying. There's no. There's no preset song. Uh, you know. You're not trying to match up with with any existing song. Instead, you're playing as a fleet of privateers, uh, a fleet of ships, each one of which is assigned to an ordinal direction. So you've got something like. Uh, uh, um, uh, you know, you've got a, a ship here that has a specific set of stats, and you've got a ship here that's got maybe the same set, maybe it's the same class of ship, and you've got another ship here which has lots more, and then maybe you've got a little ship here which is just fast, and, and so you've got ships at each of the ordinal directions, uh, or you can have, you can leave some of those areas empty if you're not confident in your ability, and you'll start with only one ship so you can build up to the idea of a complicated ship. So the idea is that each of these ships has a pattern a pattern of what they do, and that means that they have several music clips embedded in them. Uh, and I don't mean full song clips, I mean just tracks. For example, this ship here might have the track doom to doom to doom doom. It might be a drum ship, right? So if it's got doom to doom to doom doom, and you got two of them, that means you got those back to back. So you got doom to doom to doom 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 to doom to doom doom doom. Pretty straightforward, right? This ship up here might be, uh, instead of being a drum ship, it might be, uh, you know, a violin ship or something. It gives you a different track, and that layers over the top of these. And they repeat. So you got two drum tracks and a violin track. You're going to get the same violin track over and over and over again, and the two drum tracks. Uh, and if this was another track, it would depend on what kind of track it is. If it was a drum track, then it would get embedded in between these. If it was a violin track, then they would trade off. If it was uh, something that was compatible with a violin tra track, like a chanting or something, then you would get them matched up. Uh, they would they would all go at the same time. And the enemy also, of course, has some kind of challenge for you. Maybe it's mounted guns on a castle. Uh, and so they are also presenting tracks which get woven in. So uh, the idea here is that these drum ships aren't always going to be doom to doom to doom doom. The only reason that they're doom to doom to doom doom is because that's compatible with whatever you've layered on top of them. So when it comes to the meter of of the ships, they all adhere to a single meter. And if that meter changes, they just play one of the other soundtracks they've got because they all have a soundtrack for the various meters. So if this guy over here is a violin track as well, then he'll switch off with our violin track, and that may very well change what our drummers play. So you have to keep yourself alert. You're, you, you probably are pretty familiar with all of the drum tracks that your ship has but you have to know which ones are going to be playing. You have to keep your eye on the incoming fire, on the incoming balls of, uh, you know, the markers left, right, up, down. Um, and of course, doom to doom to doom doom doesn't necessarily mean you've got to hit every single note. Uh, just like in any other rhythm game, there is usually only a subset of the notes you hit, so you might only have doom to doom to doom doom might only be three. Um, but the, that's the basic idea. The basic idea is that you would build up songs, uh, you'd build up a fleet that has a music to it. Um, now, of course, the downside, the difficulty here is uh, that I know almost nothing about music. <laughs> but I thought it was an interesting enough idea that I would share it with the, uh, with the internet at large and describe what my thoughts were. Um, this prototype took me about an hour to put together mostly because I'm not very familiar with this kind of system, but it does work and uh, it'll require a lot more work before it is what I would consider ready for prime time, obviously. But uh, it's there. It works. And I like the basic idea. And that's it.